Okay. So for this, we are going to create a teenager as the new high school pack is going to be coming out. It's probably going to be out by the time this video is uploaded to my second YouTube channel. But what I'm going to do, because we never saw this individual as a teenager, I'm going to create them as a teenager. And I'm also going to create the partner that never was as a teenager and see if they can potentially have a teen high school romance and see how that goes down maybe maggie will be a you know a prep preppy cheerleader and perhaps christopher will be a jock i don't know but let's size them down age them into teenagers and um i'm gonna change their looks a little bit and make them look more young so that's gonna be the plan look how cute maggie is i'm also gonna size her down as well Okay. Oh. Sorry, chewing on an ice cream. Um. We don't know what Maggie looked like as a teen. We don't know how she grew up either. We don't know if the house, that, the cottage that she grew up in, hmm. in Brindleton Bagley. Um. We don't know if that was like where she grew up with her family or if she moved there. Has she always been into gardening? Has she always been into farming? Was she, uh, you know, a teenager that might not have dressed so far me? We don't know. So I'm going to give her a bit of a change of look. She had this look throughout the entirety of um, Sims in Bloom, pretty much. So I think we'll change it up and make it look like she's a proper teenager. You know, uh, maybe a little bit... Um, what's the word? um stereotypical maybe a stereotypical teenager but it will still be maggie so that's the plan a brindleton what's it called hemford on bagley <laughs> fina plays thank you for that follow braces do i have braces i think i might actually wait a minute um i do have braces so we will give her braces uh -huh. um This is a good show. Do we create a bit of law and try and make Maggie's parents? How would you do that? Though? Are you able to play with genetics and create the parent of someone? Is that possible or can you just do the child? Mm, sorry, I just choked on my ice cream. Parent! Bantrip, oh my god, okay. Right, we'll do... Maggie's dad is going to be called... One, two, three, Matthew Bloom. Okay. Let's take Christopher Lannister out of the equation for just a hot second. We might add him in later. Ixie, thank you for that follow, by the way. Okay, so this is her dad... Uh. Her dad is a child of the ocean, a goofball and a slob. And his CC is interesting. So I am just going to do this and we will have a, a little look at him properly. Okay, I can see Maggie. Oh my God. Okay. Yeah, he does look like he's from Game of Thrones. I've actually started watching Game of Thrones. Me and Alex have recently. Oh, only a few episodes in. Um, um, thank you for that follow as well, by the way. Okay, so we're now gonna... Oh, wait, no, we don't want that. Oh, my God, I've added a random child. Right, so we now want Maggie's mum. Oh, my God, I'm so excited. Parents, siblings, twins, and children can be made. Okay. Mm. It's dripping. Right. Parent. Oh my god! It's Maggie! This is so weird! Okay, so Maggie's mum. One, two, three. Amaya Bloom. And Amaya is... Oh, I'm going to redo that. 
Amaya is creative, dog lover, and high maintenance. Her aspiration is... Um, wants to get rich and have a successful career. Um, her dad's aspiration is computer wiz. Okay, maybe that's where Meadow ended up getting all of her playing games and computer programming thing. Interesting. Okay. So that's your wife. And um, let's work some CC on. I finished my ice cream now. Animal Crossing Girl, thank you for that follow. Um, We'll make the parents, I think. And then we'll sort out Maggie's teen look. Oh my god, this is literally so weird. This is Maggie's face. She's even got the same eye presets. They're young adults. Should we keep them as young adults or adults? Actually, that's a good idea. Yeah, maybe we'll give... Um, maybe we'll make Maggie's mum look a lot like Maggie. But with Maggie's dad, I think we'll give him perhaps like a different eye colour. So perhaps he has like blue maybe green eyes because maybe that's where meadow got her green eyes from and then maybe that mum has maggie's yellow eyes uh where is that um where are your eyes g11 like that you don't think the parents look alike they're fine okay Okay, let's do a poll as well. I'm going to just do a quick poll, you lot. Um, which... So, parents' age. Do we have them as young adults or do we have them as adults? So, that is a two-minute poll. Um, get your votes in as to whether you think the parents should be adults or young adults. Um, okay, at least we're not thinking the parents look too alike as well. They, I swear they are Maggie's lips. Did Maggie have those, like... Big sort of luscious lips. It's a bit different, actually. Her lips are bigger. So if you get your votes in in the poll, if you can see the poll at the top of chat, um, you can get your votes in there. I get so confused when the parents are young adults, but the child is a teenager, like the Ito family. Adults makes more sense with the overall story. Okay, a lot of you are agreeing. So 86% of you um, are voting for adults. So we will do adults then, as that's the majority. Um, adult. Okay, and Matthew can be an adult as well. Uh, there we go. So 61 of you did vote adults and 12 did vote young adults. So I will go with the, the majority. And we'll do Amaya first, I think. Okay, she's like the spitting image of Maggie. This is really weird. I want to make her like a cool mum though. Like I want to... Let's see... Um, it's really weird being back in like just looking at Maggie. It's it's literally like looking at Maggie, back when we first started Sims in Bloom. Um, maybe we'll do these like wispy brows like this. Hi, Chexy. Welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. Um, and then skin details i think we'll go with similar to what we gave to maggie so we gave maggie this she had cute lashes like that i think i as they're adults i will give them some lines oh maybe not like that are there ones further down question mark maybe like that like under eye lines what do we think god it's actually really weird looking at maggie's mum i don't know i uh, i think her outfit might be cc i will check when we go into that death um i'll do the lines like that for now i don't think maggie would have been too stressful as a kid she's got a perfect side profile i am gonna make the chin just a notch longer. Maggie was such a beautiful woman. I miss Maggie so much. I don't know if it was because she was my first, like, first, um, 
gen, like first generation or what, but I do miss her. Um, okay. I'm not going to give you any of that. I will give you a little bit of under eye baggage as well. We will do some nose shine. Something simple like that. This is literally Maggie. Why am I looking at Maggie right now? This is so weird. All right. Um, I'm going to give like blonde hair. So we'll do that for now. It comes out on Thursday, I think. Um, yeah, I don't think she'd be too, like, too um, harsh for mum. Because Maggie was a very relaxed mum herself. Oh, we can't do that. So we'll do that. This is so weird. This is Maggie. This is Maggie. Um, okay. To be fair, like, you do get... Oh, my God. She's so pretty. You do get, like, parents where they are literally the spitting image of their child, you know? Oh, oh this comes with Eco Living. The outfit she's wearing. So it's not CC. It's actually really gorgeous. God, Eco Living had some beautiful stuff. Is it mum, mum vibes, though? I really like this, though. Uh, it's a cute little outfit. You think the hair's a bit too young? Okay. My daughter looks very similar to me. People have thought we were twins. Yeah, you know, it does happen. Maybe it's Maggie's mum's pursuit of wealth is what brought Maggie to have a simpler life. They might have gone for a big fight that explains why they weren't part of their life at the start of Sims in Bloom. That is a good idea, Cocoon. That's so true. Yeah, because Maggie's mum wants to be fabulously wealthy, whereas obviously we saw Maggie and Maggie was in like living in a cottage on her own in Brindleton Bay. So, like, that's a really good idea. I love that cocoon. Okay. Lai, thank you for that follow. Welcome on in. Classic, do it. Once you install Alpha CC, there's no going back. God, I have a lot of S Club hairs that I need to repair. Dan literally told me how and I still haven't done it. Okay. Uh, my hair's long. It can stay long. It looks great. I'll never cut my hair. That's true. Yeah. Nicole's got very long, luscious locks. I think I like that hair. I kind of want to keep it, to be honest. Like that. Yeah, I like that hair. Maggie, Maggie literally cooked with what she found. Total 180. Oh, yeah. She lived on um, a simple living lot trait, didn't she? I forgot about that. Yeah, I, I like that. That's pretty. I like the idea that she's like a young mum as well. Like, she's not a mum that dresses like she's like, you know, middle-aged. I like I like this. And I love the Eco outfit as well. Eco did bring some really good um, clothes. Especially, I think, doesn't Eco have some quite good uh, toddler clothes as well? I'm going to keep that on her because I like it. Um, Maybe we'll do... Some like wedges. She's so maggy. I'm loving it. Depressed cheese, welcome on in. You like it as well. Uh, Meadow moved to Brindleton Bay. Simple living. Um, no, so this is Maggie's mum. This is Maggie's mum. They look very similar, as we can sort of tell. It's very weird, but it is what it is. Oh my god, I love the beret. Let's keep the beret. But let's put her in like... Let's see. The beret is a whole vibe. Um, is there a white version of the beret? Okay, we'll just do that. Eco is such a great pack um, in every aspect. In every respect, cast, build, buy, gameplay, best day ever did. Yeah, so we're going to be, with Gen 3, we're going to be exploring the Eco pack a little bit more because Indy's going to move to Evergreen Harbour and um you know do fabrication and stuff so yeah i'm excited uh person thank you for that follow welcome on in welcome welcome um maybe ansley actually that's a good idea have i got we could make christopher i've got christopher do i have what was his name
What's the guy? Oh, I don't know if I've got him. Oh, I do. Timothy. Do we add? Should we add them all? Christopher Lannister, Timothy, and Valentino. Do I add them all as teens? That could be really fun to all be in high school together. Um, welcome on in person. I, I don't remember you. That's actually your first time uh, speaking in chat as you created your account two minutes ago. Um, so I'm afraid that I don't remember you. Timothy, yeah. I think we'll make them as teens as well and see see about some drama. I think that could be fun. Valentino, because they met in Solani. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, we won't do Valentino then, but we will do the others. We'll do the others. It's it's uh it's gonna be interesting. It's a bit of lore for our Sims and Bloom essentially. And then what I might do is I'm wondering, like, do I do it as like a main channel series on YouTube? Or what are we thinking? At least we don't need to give colour like own certain colours that she can have. They are some chonky trainers. Let's do it. Sleepwear. Oh, that's a new werewolves outfit. Uh, we'll do this like eco chill vibe thing. And the joggers she's got on are fine. Uh, I think that'd be cool. I think it'll be good. Spin-off series. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Oh my God, look at this dress. That is stunning. That is... <gasps> This is maybe where she gets the cottage living vibe. So she's wearing cottage living, um, cottage living outfits. I don't know. Maybe they moved there at one point. I don't know. But we will put her in a cottage living outfit just for whatever. Oh my god, those lashes are not yet. There we go. Um, make a mean girl cheerleader from back in the day. We could do that as well. Yeah, that's a good idea. I say add them all to see what would happen if they had all met as teens and give them all equal chance. That's true, Meg, because it is a spin-off. Like, it's not it's not linking up to the main series, is it? And it's not going to be in the main series gameplay. So maybe we do add them all. Kangaroo lover, welcome on in. Now I'm wondering, what was my plan for Thursday stream? Maybe on Thursday, we just focus on the cast. Because I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to I'm going to sort out Meadow as a teen and do like her mum and dad. And then maybe what, what, what was I originally scheduled in for Thursday stream? Crowd control. Maybe we'll do that next week. 100 baby speed run. Maybe we'll do that next week. And on Thursday stream, we'll prepare for the pack and we'll make a load of high school students and we'll do like the likes of who we've said, uh, you know, so what Meg said as well, doing Valentino, Christopher, Timothy. I think we'll also... Wait, have I got Leandra? Hmm. Yes, I have Leandra as well. So we'll do Leandra as well um, as a as a, a um, teenager because they probably met in school. I think that'd be a good idea. The mean girl chili could have been dating Chris and then got jealous of Maggie and Drama Llama. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, we've got loads to work with here once once the pack comes out. But yeah, I think we'll do that too. This is going to be really weird, actually, to see, isn't it? But I think, yeah, what we'll do then is... So um, tomorrow's stream, we'll play Sims in Bloom. Wait, is there a base game update tonight? Did somebody say? What would have happened if they all met in high school? Exactly. Um... Did somebody say there's a base game update tonight? Because if my mods all break, or if some of my mods break, then Sims in Bloom is not going to be on the cards for tomorrow. Um, base game update is early-ish tomorrow. Okay, we'll see if... Um, we'll see if it's like before stream. Body, hair, and sexual orientation. Is that tomorrow, like, morning? Or is it going to be in the, like, after my stream time? Um, let's do, let's do that, I think. Because we'll play it by ear, so we'll either see. Hopefully, um, 
it's after stream and we can do Sims and Bloom tomorrow. And then like by the time um by the time we then go back and play on Thursday, it'll be all up to date. Sour Wildflower, thank you for that follow. Welcome on in. Before stream, okay. Well then we'll play it by ear, because if my mods break, then I won't be playing Sims in Boom. Okay, um Right, mum vibes. You are a mum. No. Uh Right, let's do that. And we'll do this. Right. I'm really excited now for this gameplay, actually. I'm really looking forward to it. Right, do some jeans and then do... Right, some trainers. Some... Okay, I'm just going to sort her eyes out because they're not the same. Welcome in, Diamond. This is um, Maggie's mum from my Sims and Bloom series. Right. Do this. I'll do a little bit of makeup on her, but I'm not going to do a lot. Maggie actually really wasn't a Sim that wore a lot of makeup. So I might do like a very light amount on her mum. It's making you want to play The Sims again, Leanne. Uh, every Sim is pansexual by default, default, but the update brings choices. So was that, I didn't actually watch that um, live stream. I think I was going out or something. Um, but that's something that's mega exciting as well. I'd be intrigued to see how that sort of works. Um, I reckon it might break some mods as well. So hopefully they get fixed and then it all works together. Okay. They're adding the wants and fears system. Oh, so that'll cause issue with women related mods. That's really cool. That's um that's something that, you know, it's been in previous games, so super exciting to have that like finally coming back. Okay, we'll do that and then we'll do like the smallest bit. Okay. And then more little bit. Not a lot, just a little. Okay. So this is a Maya Bloom. This is Maggie's mum. Um, let's have a little look at her dad. So her dad is Matthew Bloom. He, yeah, he doesn't look like Maggie. I can see Maggie in him, but he definitely looks very different in my opinion. Um... He looks really interested, actually. Okay, I'm really excited to give him his CC makeover. Um, let's give him some thick brows. Let's move the brows up a little bit, I think. And bring that down. Pandora Cakes, thank you so much for that follow. Welcome into the stream. Welcome to the community. Okay, can I, like... I can see Maggie in him, actually. I really can. But he does look very different on his own. So let's whack some CC. And let's see. Oh, wait. Okay. I don't know what you're wearing, but I'm going to take off this. Okay. This is interesting. I will be doing a show challenge probably um maybe September will be my next show. Uh I think we'll do that. And then I also want to give him some like wrinkles as well. Maybe What's it like without, with, without? Maybe like that. Okay. I think he'd be like a really happy chappy, you know? I feel like he'd be quite a happy dad and very like supportive of Meadow and, uh, sorry, Maggie. Okay, uh, we'll do some freckles. 
Uh, not the moment, Deliverance, no. I think we are just going to stick to the mum and dad and Meadow. Um, we'll just leave it as that because she didn't have siblings. So we'll just do, yeah, just do mum and dad. Um, let's put some eye bags like that. I have lots of CC, Nelly. Welcome on in. Oh, really? Do the curved walls come tomorrow, you lot? Is it in tomorrow's update? He gives me stay at home dad with a side hustle vibes in the best way possible, like always there for his kids, yeah. Uh, perhaps they live in the new neighborhood in a biggish house with the mum's influence. So, yeah, I will definitely move them to the new neighborhood, 100%. Okay. Um, not that nose, we'll do maybe that. Uh, he looks very different, I think. Still similar to Maggie, but different in his own way. And I think I might give him, like, brown hair. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go for... Let's see. Leah, thank you for that follow. Welcome on in. I really like him, actually. He just looks like a cheerful, like, very supportive dad. I don't know. I like that hairstyle. I really like him. I think I like that hairstyle. I'm not going to lie. Okay, I'm going to stick with that for now. Is he quite buff? Because I get the feeling that he would be quite buff. Oh my god, he's quite buff. I'm going to make him even buffer. Let's do... Oh my god, I'm loving Matthew. Maybe uh, he does look like a chill dad. Maybe that's where Maggie gets her chilledness from. Yeah, this is it. Although he is a slob. But I want him to be buff, so I'm making him buff. Oh my god, I'm loving him. This is really weird, actually. It's like what would um, like Maggie's son have looked like if she'd have had a boy, you know? Maybe. Okay. We do need to give him the green eyes all over. Uh, which one was it? Okay, the middle one. Where are you? Uh, okay, green. And then... Green again. Very annoying having to put eyes on one by one, but it's fine. Thank you, Chloe, for the drink water. Uh, that's an idea. He, yeah. That's actually a really good link. So he is a child of the ocean. And obviously, Maggie ended up going to Solani. So yeah, maybe the fact that her dad was like a child of the ocean and loved Solani is what drew Maggie to go to Solani. And then that's where she obviously ended up meeting Valentino, her future husband, and Lila's future dad. That's a really good idea. I'm loving the law and I'm loving how like it's all linking in and this isn't even like you know we haven't created this it's just the game that's automatically doing it like with a, re a re-roll you know okay um i don't know liv i mean stay at home dads you know still have time to work on their appearance and style their hair you know, it, it probably doesn't take excessively long for his hair to sort of look like this, especially if it's quite short. I think um, I think I'll leave it as it is. I quite like how he looks with it. Okay. Right, let's sort out. So every day, dad vibes. Um, he does look friendly. That's what I like about him. Omelette Fairy, hello. Welcome on in. How are you doing? I hope you're having a good Monday. Um, We'll give him... Maybe like a shirt. Hot dad mm. vibes. Um, let's see. Uh, 
Um, Omelet Fairy, thank you so much for that follow as well. Meadow is a teen, so maybe a bit more time for his interests. Yeah, that's true. Like he doesn't have a young, a young kiddo to sort of be taken care of. The type of dad who welcomes everyone, wholesome vibes. Yeah. Oh, I like him. Okay, let's do that. God, he is buff. I'm gonna make him even more buff. Love that for him. Um, okay. Do some of this. Uh, if I was Maggie's friend, I'd go around her house to chat with her dad, literally. I'd be like, so Maggie, do you want to invite me over to, uh, <laughs> over to your house after school today? A hundred percent. Okay, formal. Formal, formal, formal. Okay, we're going to be wearing... Maybe a nice, like, shirt. Mm, I like this, maybe. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. Love that. And perhaps some trousers. Okay. Oh, thank you, Charles. And Angelina, welcome on in. How are you doing? Okay, Hottie McHot face is looking good. Love this green outfit, so I'm actually going to keep that. I am going to make that white. And we'll make your shoesies. Which shoes are they? We'll make them green. Sleepwear, you can wear absolutely nothing. Uh, we'll do some Calvin Klein pants, and that is all. Uh, we will also, in party wear, do... Um, let's see. Mm, maybe that with a shirt. You had a fantastic weekend. That's good to hear. That is good to hear. Oh, my God. Love a man in out. Oh, look at that. A man in uniform. Whew. Yeah, this guy's hot. I like him. Um, let's do... That's my weakness. What a man in uniform. Yeah. I do like this guy. I wish Maggie's dad was in the main series now. Okay. Swimwear. Woo! Right, we'll do that. That's hot. You can wear that for your hot weather. And cold weather. That looks massive on you, but we'll do that. You should be in every series, literally. <laughs> every single... Next baby daddy? Matthew Bloom. Okay, so this is Matthew. Why have you got a question mark by you? Daughter and husband. Why, why is that so difficult for the game to acknowledge? Huh? Daughter, wife. Why is she got... Okay, right. So this is uh, Amaya Bloom. This is Maggie's mum. Beautiful. This is Matthew Bloom. Uh, Maggie's hot dad unsurprisingly hot obviously like maggie was gorgeous and maggie is now aged down into a teenager so let's give her a different appearance and let's give her a teenage appearance so oh wait no i'll keep that on get rid of that and let's have a little look at her hair Cute couple. I'm glad you like them. Queen of Rito, welcome in. Such a gorgeous family. I cannot even with these people. I love them. Okay. How is Maggie going to have her hair in high school? And what kind of person would she be in high school? That's kind of cute. Very sort of teeny, I think. Is there like anything to go with that? Like a clip or something? Um, that could work. 
No, the clips can't be seen. That could work. Um, she's a very pretty sim. She's stunning, isn't she? I've missed Maggie's cute face. Um, I do like this hair. I think it's it's quite teeny. Okay, not that. Hmm. That's kind of cute. Oh gosh. Mm, I'll look at the other heads, but hmm. I quite like that one. Um. Did she have that hair at one point? I mean, that one could work with the bubbles. That could be like a cheerleader vibe pair as well, to be fair. Like that, maybe. And then we could like grow our hair out. Um. Also, did, um, did I see Nicole say earlier that there were braces in... Thingy. Oh, there is base game braces. Okay, we'll do them and we'll do them multicolored. Yeah. Okay, oh my god, look at her with braces. Ah, that's so weird looking at her like that. Okay, I love it though. Right, take the outfit and we'll go high school. She's in high school. No, that's not. Ooh. Not high schooly. Maybe. Hmm. Let's see. Anything like here that would be. That's too formal, I think. Could do this sort of vibe, which is what Lila's literally wearing at the minute. Or Maeve even. Hmm. Maybe something like that. She's so cute, isn't she? The overalls with the fox. That was from the Cottage Living pack. That's Cottage Living. That's a really good pack. Um... Maybe we do... <laughs> Her tattoo. No, we will get rid of the tattoo. Thank you for reminding me. Sorry. Yeah. Get rid of that. Thank you. Yeah, the tattoo's gone. Completely forgot about that. Thank you. Yeah, no tat. Gets it after high school. TMX, uh, thank you for that follow. Welcome in. And Libby, welcome in as well. Um, okay. Little skirt is what I'm now looking for. Um, maybe like that. And then she... I like those, like, wonky shoe, uh, wonky socks. Maybe she keeps them and she... It's like those little daisy trainers. Like that. That could be cute. Thank you for the water reminder. And Law, welcome in as well. Bastet Milo, thank you for that follow. Um, okay. Let's paint her nails and let's do pink. Is there like a nice light pink? Mm, let's do that. I love this outfit and of course the cardio. I think it's cute. Cute little high school girly whirly. I think we'll, we won't do any makeup. She's just a teen, but she's got her braces on as well. Let's just do that. 
Uh, yeah, she's got a look at how with her little braces. <laughs> okay, um, let me check like her, like, oh my god, yeah, she's proper old in that. Let's change her hair for all these. So, do that. Mm, that one looks a lot older. I think we'll still go with like the young look. So it's that hair. That hair is... Where is that? Mm. Okay. And Tali, th hello Tali, thank you for that follow. Welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing, cute head? Change the hair bubbles to blue or pink. Oh, that's a good idea. We can do pink and blue. Okay, perfect. Thank you for reminding me, Shan. There we go. Okay, so that's Maggie's little teen look ready for the high school pack we'll just do her little other outfits now i am gonna remove her makeup although wait a minute go back a step i want to remove like liner and stuff but i don't want to remove her actual eyes leanne welcome on in um i've not done the not so berry we're currently doing uh simpson bloom uh maggie's so cute hello tally thank you she's a little cute head i love it i hope you're doing well my love it's good to see you uh, wait a minute. I want to get rid of just the earrings. Yes, okay. And let's give her like a formal dress. But she's a teen, so we want it to be like teeny. Maybe, hmm, maybe something like that or, oh gosh, I don't know. That's not very teeny. Maybe this could be teeny shan louise thank you for that follow as well her face gives her a sweet look she's precious <laughs> she is cute head uh okay i'm not sure about that gosh i don't know what outfit to give her for this okay what is these are a bit too alpha, I think. They're a little bit too much. Yes, we will see Maggie go to prom. We will. I uh, feel like this should be a prom dress. Oh, gosh. Have I got any prom dresses for her? That's a bit booby. As is that. Would you wear that to prom? I mean, it's cute, to be fair. Uh, how old are they when they go to prom? How old was I? I can't even remember. Is it end of year 11? Okay. Not sure my school would have allowed it. You're 17 slash 18 when you go to prom. Junior, senior, yes, so 17, 18. Okay. Hmm, maybe even that one or... You were 18 at your prom. Uh... I don't know if I've got any, like... What's this one? Maybe this one. That one's a little bit more child-friendly. Let's do this one, new lot. Yeah. Although it is a little bit raunchy, but... Let's do that one. And then shoes. Go for this, like, creamy colour. And then, okay. Right. Let's change this, because we've looked at her in that many times in Simpson Bloom. We shall do like a jumper. Uh, oh, that's cute. I like that. We'll do that and then we'll do some little shorts to go with it. And then... Okay, that's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. 
No, we we'll just do some chill shorts. She's got a teeny wa tiny waist, which I'm very jealous of. Sleepwear will put you in. Hmm. Maybe. No. <laughs> Maybe this. Okay, that's fine. You can wear the daisy things to be fair for party. I might leave that. That's kind of a teeny look. And I might just leave that as a notion to old Maggie. Swimwear, I am going to change that just to maybe like, I don't know. This, that's cute. This will change to... Uh, we'll keep the little farmy vibe. Maybe the blue and... Perhaps a little white skirt. That's kind of sweet. With some little white sandals. And then cold weather, I'm going to get rid of the scarf. See you later, Charles. And maybe we'll do... Oh, gosh. Uh... Okay, this is cute. We we'll do that. And those jeans. Actually, I like this look. And then maybe change this to pink. Okay. This is teen Maggie. Oh my god, it's really weird to look at her as a teen. But this is teen Maggie as a teenager. So Maggie is going to be our protagonist when the high school pack came out. She's going to be our main character alongside her dad, Matthew Bloom. And her mum and Amaya Bloom as well. I am just going to size Maggie down, actually, while we're here. So can I just actually go into body and do it through that? Bodies and we'll make her schmoll. Okay, perfect. So yeah, there you go. Those are our, our ready-made characters for the high school thing. I'm going to just save them to my library as well as high school pack. And then on Thursday stream, we will go ahead and also change into teenagers the other characters in our Sims and Bloom series. So we'll be giving a teenage makeover to Leandra, who was, as we, if you've seen my Sims and Bloom challenge, you'll recognise as Maggie's best friend. We'll also give a teen makeover to Christopher Lannister, who never became Maggie's partner, although he desperately wanted to. We will also give a teen makeover to Christopher, not Christopher, what was his name? Timothy, Timothy Fisher. Um, he will get a teen makeover as well. And we'll also give Valentino a teen makeover. So we'll do that on Thursday stream. So for now, I'm just gonna do a save. And um, we'll, we'll save that save as well. And Jemmy, welcome on in. How are you doing? Or Jemima even, welcome on in. Um, I'm just going to move them in here, but we're not obviously going to play with them. Actually, can I just like save? I have got them saved to my library as well, so this doesn't really matter too much. But yeah, they are saved in this world and they are also now saved to my library. So there we go.